see like 100, eventually like 100 gigawatt hours of, of yeah. uh, batteries a year. 100 gigawatt hours. We think probably more of it, yeah. And they're actually being produced right now already here, right? They're in production there's a, there's, already. You guys put out this video. Yeah. I mean, does that speed it up? Or? That's, the, that's the slowed down version. So how, yeah. how fast does it actually go? Well, um, when it's running at full speed, um, you can't actually see the cells without a strobe light. <laughs> it's just blur. <laughs> and how, I mean... Semi, these houses, is, is the, the falling price of lithium-ion batteries, which you've made a huge bet on as, as, as Tesla. In many yeah. ways, that's almost the core competency. And, and um, you, you've decided that to really, like, um, own that competency. You, you just have to build the world's largest manufacturing part and kind of double the world's supply of lithium-ion batteries. Yeah. Is with, with, with this guy, what is this? Yeah, so that's, that's the Gigafactory, um, the, the progress so far in the Gigafactory. Uh, eventually, you can sort of roughly see that there's, it's a, there's sort of a diamond shape overall. When, when it's fully done, it'll, be, it'll look like a giant diamond. Well, that's the idea behind it. And it's aligned on true north. There's a small detail there. And, um, and capable of producing like 100, eventually like 100 gigawatt hours of, of yeah. uh, batteries a year? 100 gigawatt hours. We think probably more of it, yeah. And they're actually being produced right now already here, right? They're in production there's, there's, already. There's, you guys put out this video. Yeah. I mean, does that speed it up, or...? That's the, that's the slowed-down version. So how, yeah. how, how fast does it actually go? Well, um, when it's running at full speed, um, you can't actually see the cells without a strobe light. <laughs> it's just blur. <laughs> and how, I mean, one of, your, one of your core ideas, Elon, about, about what makes an exciting future is a future where we no longer feel guilty about energy. Um, how, help us picture this. I mean, how many gigafactories, if you like, does it take to, to get us there? Uh, it's about 100, roughly. It's not 10, it's not 1,000, most likely 100. See, I, I, I kind of yeah. find this amazing. Like, you can actually picture, if, if that's right, you can picture what it would take to move the world off this vast yeah. fossil fuel thing. It's like, you're building one, costs $5 billion, maybe the next one, or whatever, 5 to $10 billion. Yeah. Like, it's... It's kind of cool that you can picture that, that project. And you're planning to do uh, a Tesla, or at least another two, announce another two this year. I think we'll, we'll announce locations for somewhere between two and four gigafactories later this year. Yeah, probably four. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. I can't, I can't tease, te no more teasing from you for here. Like, where? Continent? <laughs> <laughs> Um, you can say no. I, I, we need to address a global market. Yeah. Okay. I, uh, <laughs> this is cool. Um, <laughs> I think we should talk for... Actually, global market. So I'm, I have to ask you one question. I'm going to ask you one question about politics. Only one. I'm kind of sick of politics, uh, but I do need to ask you this. Um, your... your um, on um, a body now giving advice to a guy who, who? <laughs> has said he doesn't really believe in climate change. And um, there's, there's a lot of people out there who kind of think you shouldn't be doing that. They, they'd like you to walk away from that. What would you say to them? Uh, well, I think that th there's... Eric, first of all, I'm just on two advisory councils where the format consists of going around the room and asking people's opinion on things. Um, and so there's like a meeting every month or two. Uh, you know, that's the sum total of, 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 of my contribution. But I think to the degree that there are people in the room who are arguing in favor of doing something about climate change um, or, you know, other, you know, certain, you know social issues. Um, uh, you know, I mean, I mean I've used the, t the, the meetings I've had thus far to argue in favor of immigration and in favor of climate change. Um, and if... Um, if I hadn't done that, there wouldn't, that wasn't on the agenda before. So maybe nothing will happen, but at least the words were said. Okay. Um.